This program contains graphic material, including offensive language and adult situations. Viewer discretion is advised. The Midwest. Someone walks onto the wrong course with the wrong colored disc. A young man opens fire on the unsuspecting victim. The young man is a member of a gang here known simply as TDK. Yeah, that's right, baby. Tide-eye killers out here doing their big. Eh! Anybody come in my hood rocking nothing but tie-dye? It's going down. Their memberships range from 5 to 10 for each group. These dangerous groups of young men and women thrive in the greens of your own backyard. Yeah, we thriving. T. A. R. Riding. Yeah, you wanna think I hit Ayo, shit is crazy, son. Ayo, check out my family's playing with, son. Shit is crazy, son. Ayo, tell the folks at home what type of dish that is, son. See this right here? This is the 100% Todd I make, baby. <laughs> they're pests. They're just out there starting trouble because their parents never care. We go deep into the cavity of this anal world. I mean heinous world. Where brotherhood is king and froth reigns supreme. Let's journey to Seymour Smith Park, somewhere in the middle of the map, to visit one of the most dangerous froth groups in the Midwest, the Tie-Dye Killers, otherwise known as TDK. Frothin's a way of life. I've been frothin' ever since I can remember. About two or three years ago, me and my homies went down to the course, drank some beers, get some bitches, and I just thought to myself all of a sudden, like, yo, let's start a freaking gang. Violence is a big part of the gang's culture. To be a TDK killer, you gotta get launched in. Launching is where if you wanna be a TDK killer, we all surround you for an undisclosed amount of time and we launch our frisbees at you. Absolutely shocking. Even at such a young age, violence is deeply rooted in this society. Now let's visit another part of the course, to visit a group who considers themselves to be the most dangerous froth group in the country. Would you think this is a freaking game over here? Well, technically it is a game, eh? ain't it? There is currently a froth war between three gangs, which is an ongoing battle that has lasted for over two years. A war that stretches between three equally divided sections of the course. The north end of the course is controlled by the tie-dye killers. Now let's take a more in-depth view of the park where the gangs really make you feel like family. Yeah, La Frafioso, baby. We hate the TDK and the freaking Los Frafifos. Yeah! If they ever step foot over here, yeah! Let's just say it won't be pretty. Yeah! Get the freak out of my ear over here! Hey! They have absolutely no regard for life. In La Fulfioso, your status in the gang depends on how much money you bring into the gang. Four Finger Freddy, a member of La Fulfioso, asked to have his face and voice disguised. You gotta strive to be the best at it. The more you earn, the more respect you earn from your gang. These young men and women have many different ways of earning money on their territory. Me personally, I like to get my money from Fazoli's. The freaking Fazoli problem here isn't too bad, you know what I mean? But when we see an unsuspecting Fazoli on our turf, it's our policy to dispose of them in a gruesome, yet timely manner. Now we'll take you to the south point of the course. Come with us as we discover the lifestyle of the most rowdy of the Froth Gangs. Los Frothifos. Anyone can join Los Frothifos, but once you enter the gang, there is no way out. Once you're part of Los Frothifos, it's for life. Los Frothifos is the largest Froth Gang, with its membership reaching nearly 20. Chico, one of Los Frothifos' senior members, has been with Los Frothifos for over three years. You are bleed lost fluffy for songs. You know, I never want to get out. It's for me. 
Though anyone can join, Los Frolfifos thrive with members from some of the poor community. You know I got to keep up with my game, homes. This way, right this is a dog the Yo, we don't waste no food, no way, Jose, you know what I mean? Yo, you screw up and you mess a shot. Yo, pass me some boy, you want some salsa, homie, I'm about to make me a fajita. No way, Jose. Yo, no joke, son. I don't play around. These kids gonna come with the sun dried, the spinach tortilla. Yo, I'm old school, son. I still roll with the flour. I get crazy too, homes. Are you willing to switch blades for a bar? I live and die, but they put the end. Some people think the war is all about power and greed. But what the gangs really pride themselves on is the love of froth. Don't nobody mess with an audio, home. What? Nah, baby. No, oh, they're just scared. Hold up. It's my mom. We have reached the end of our journey into this complex world of froth gangs. Their stories, however treacherous, have defined the culture and will remain engraved in the annals of history. As the gangs evolve, the newest members will carve their own place in history. I'm lost fluffy fuss. I never want to get that, yo. This is my fan. I'll do whatever it takes to take care of. If you go over bar, eh, one time I let it slide. Two times you go over bar or you go bogey, I'm taking the pinky. And the black market of pinky is roughly 500 pesos. This thing. <laughs> <laughs> Walk and walk and walk and walk and walk and walk and walk.